MedStar Franklin Square Medical Center uses the most up-to-date treatments to give their patients the best possible care. They are the first hospital in Maryland to successfully use a new FDA-approved lung valve in emphysema treatments. And here to tell us more about this exciting new advancement is Dr. Sai Sarkar, along with his patient, Earl Brown, and Earl's wife, Linda. Welcome, you three. Happy to have you here. Nice Thank to you. be here. So tell me a little bit more about this treatment. Sure. So with advanced emphysema patients, their main issue is they are hyperinflated. When the lung's hyperinflated, it doesn't function well, and that usually results in breathlessness, decrease in exercise, and a poor quality of life. This new minimally invasive treatment, basically you, we take the most diseased portion of the lung, we place a one-way valve, which does not allow any further air into that segment and allows the air that's already trapped out. What happens is that area collapses and over time the patient then will be allowed to experience less breathlessness, uh, more exercise tolerance and a better quality of life. Previously, what was the treatment and how does this differ? So basically treatments prior to this was medical management where you have inhaler, inhalers, oxygen and uh, exercise programs. The most extreme was invasive procedures such as lung surgery. This minimally invasive procedure fits in between if the patient's the appropriate candidate. Got it. And Earl, you were one of the appropriate candidates. Yeah. You had this procedure done. How has it changed your life? What did you experience? Well, I'm going through the right now. I can go up and take a shower when I want to. Before, I couldn't take a nice shower. Mm -hmm. So I can do this now, and I can go up and down and step fine now. Wow. So it, it's really working for me. It's really working yes, for you. Yes, I can help my wife around the house. Yes, I'm sure you like that, I, Linda, I, yeah, right? I, did. I really <laughs> do. He's, he's, he's came a long, long way. Yes. And Dr. Sakar, I want to thank you for allowing this treatment to help an Earl get better because he is doing better. He's doing a lot better. Going down to take the trash and not pausing three or four times, that's wonderful. And when you hear that, the quality of life from your patient, your patient's family, how does it make you feel as a doctor being able to introduce this new treatment? And it is life-changing. Mm -hmm. um, it's probably the best feeling. Um, it's humbling to know that you've changed someone's life, uh, yeah. things that we take granted every day. Really, Correct. take for granted every day, yeah. Correct. And so you've seen the change in Earl. When, except for the cooking. Except for the cooking. That's yeah. okay. We can't have it all. <laughs> <laughs> but you've seen the change. We can laugh now. I yeah. mean, because he's feeling yeah. better. Yeah. Yes. And so, but when they approached you about this new treatment, did you have any hesitation or did they put your minds at ease right away? It was up to him. And I told him, it's all up to you. This is your body. You yes. have to do it for yourself. Not for me, not for your granddaughter. It's up to you. Right. And, and I, I wanted to try it because anything was better than what I was going through with the suffocation. I couldn't breathe. Yes. And I, I just gave it a try, and it worked. It worked. And so what would you tell people who are watching today, and they think, you know, I'm a little apprehensive, but, you know, Earl... the surgery done. Do it. Try it. I, believe me, I wouldn't lie to you. Okay. Try it. It works. And so if someone, you said they have to be the right candidate though. Yes. So describe the process. If someone is watching right now and they're... Sure. So you can have your doctor call us at the uh, number that will be provided mm -hmm. or you can call yourself and what we'll do is we go through a bunch of uh, preliminary screening tests and we make sure you have the appropriate um, you know, selection criteria and that's all based on research that we have done in the last several years to show who will benefit the most from the procedure. Great, and I want to thank you three so much for being here. And you can learn more by going to medstarfranklinsquare.org and calling the number on your screen if you have any questions and getting in touch with the doctor and his staff. We'll be right back right after this. Stay tuned.